G'day guys, how's it going? It is Jared HD here. Welcome to episode number 72 of the FIFA 16 My Player Career Mode series. If you do go on to enjoy today's episode, make sure that you leave a like on the video. We are in the back end of this series. It's been a wonderful journey and I am keen to finally conclude it. Also, make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you are new around here. We are posting career mode content every single day. But on that note, let's get into today's episode. We will kick things off with another training session, chasing after the elusive 99 rating. We're running out of time to really hit it, so let's see if we can have a couple of good training sessions to wrap up the series and push for 99. So in this one, we go all right, B's and D's all around the shop. Anyways, we have been selected here to take on Sevilla in the La Liga, so let's get into that game. So it turns out it's actually in the Copa del Rey, the second leg of this clash against Sevilla. We did win the first leg 4-1, so let's hope we just hold on to it. If we lose from here, then that's going to be abysmal. Here is, so it is the quarterfinals, and... Atletico Madrid is 2-1 down, that is surprising to see. We are the player to watch because we did score that amazing hat-trick in the last league against Sevilla. Here is the Sevilla lineup. so Silicon in goals, Laporte, who else is there? Lorente, Konoplyanka, Ibora, they've got a very good side. And then here is our lineup. so Kiko Casilla in goals. We are up front, Hannes Rodriguez, Cristiano Ronaldo... Pass it to us. Here we go, Hammers. We're going to go back to him. Go on, Hammers. What can he do? He goes outside. Ronaldo. We're going to sit back and call for it. Going back through to Ronaldo, who hits it, but it's straight at Sillison. Gareth, what's he going to do? He's going to pass it to us. We're going to hit it. No, we get tackled, but Lucas Toro has a crack of his own. Lorente through to Reyes here. Good opportunity. He squares it back off the post. Reyes gets to the rebound. Can he do anything with it? No, he can't. Yes, Hammers, playing this one through. We're getting past one defender with absolute ease. Passing that one short to Hammers. Come in. We're on. Here we go. We're going to hit it first time. Straight at Silison. Fabio Cohen Trow playing it through to us. What can we do? We go back there to Cohen Trow, who comes to us. We're going to bang that one. Takes a deflection. Almost into the back of the net off that deflection. Danilio, passing this one to us. We go through there. Tackled in the box. We're going to hit it on the rebound. Oh, 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 thought we might have sent us into the lead with the lead. Uh, into the lead with the lead. Into the halftime break with the lead. Ava Benega on the attack. Going to Connor Plianka. They make the tackle. Ava Benega back to Tremolanus. Can they get a goal back and give them a little bit of hope in this game? Bora. Bora hits it but just misses. Oh, intercepted here. Cristiano Ronaldo passing that one to us. We're going to cut around. Playing it through there. Isco flicking it. He has the strike, but it's straight at Sillison. Isco passing this one. We're going to play it over the top to Isco. Get there. Isco hits it. Isco gives us the lead. 1-0 here. 5-1 on aggregate. And we're going to be heading into the semi-finals of the Copa del Rey. And I, I, I'm going to ask for a substitution here. Laporte gets booked for some reason, but I am going to ask for a substitution. We are going to come off, as you can see here. I'm sure the lads can hold on to a 5-1 aggregate lead for about, what, 25 minutes. So with 10 hours remaining, we are on transfer deadline day. And taking a look at the business we've done, it's been pretty poor to say the least. Brought in two players with a combined value of four million pounds and three players out 30 million pounds. So let's hope the board have something special planned for deadline day. Although in retrospect, they probably blew all their transfer budget on us. And with one hour to go, we signed one new player there, Correa Amado, and we sold two more. Vallejo is gone and Medran also, so... Not a very good transfer window there. A lot of money back into the club, but we haven't brought anyone in. Following the end of the transfer window, we have the El Clasico. It is in La Liga. It is at the Santiago Bernabeu. And of course, it is Barcelona. Taking a look at the table, Barcelona, 8th position. Can you believe it? We are top of the table. Four points clear. What is going on at the Camp Nou? Barcelona, 8th place. 
Jesus. We've only allowed five goals all season. That is insane. So here is our lineup for today's game. We are up front. Isco's there. Bale, Ronaldo, the main man, Modric, Schweinsteiger, Ramos, Varane. That is a very strong side. Taking a look at this Barcelona lineup. Suarez, Messi. Who else is there? Testagen, Mascherano, Busquets. It's identical, basically, to what they have in real life now. They've got Sandro, so I don't know where it's going wrong for them. They're on the attack, Barcelona. Well tackled there. Come on, let's make a highlight happen. It's been a dull first half. We get tackled, but we keep on going. We're running. We're going to play that one through. Get there, Isco. Are you quicker than Mascheran? Oh, no, you're not. Holy shit. What a boring first half. The halftime whistle just went. Not a single highlight. They're on the attack here. Sandro through to Rakitic for Barcelona. What a poor shot there. Goes there. Comes to us. What can we do? Cutting around. Running. We're going to hit it. Oh, save from Testagen. That's like the first real highlight of the game on our end. So we have a corner here. We're going to run to the penalty spot where we normally go. It comes in. Oh, goes straight back out though. Lucas Vazquez. Goes to Hammers. Why would you do a flare pass there? We get the ball back anyways. We hit it, but it's caught from Testagen. Full time, fellas. And that wraps up one of the boringest games I have played this FIFA. A nil all draw in the El Clasico against Barcelona. What a dull game. Another training session here, identical to the previous one. We'll just go ahead and simulate it. So, come on, Jared Nance. Grow in something. Nope. And the final matchup in today's episode is on the road once again in La Liga against Ibar. Let's hope we can bang in a few more goals than we did against Barcelona. So this is the La Liga table. We're still four points clear with a game in hand. Ibar struggling a little bit down in 12th. So hopefully we can put them to the sword. We are averaging a goal a game. 20 appearances, 20 goals. That is remarkable. Here is the Ibar lineup. Don't really recognize any of the players. Just trying to have a good look at their lineup. And nope, don't recognize the names. And then here is our lineup. So a bit of a rotational side, but still pretty damn strong. Sherry Chev, Vazquez, Rodriguez is in there. I don't know why Rodriguez is such a rotational player in this side, but they've got Semedo as well. Early corner here. We're going to run and throw our hand up for it. Goes in there. We go for the header. It's almost an own goal, I think. Do we win the tackle? Yes, we do. Here we go. Running sideways. Playing it through. Get the hammers. Oh. They're on the attack here. You knew he running down the line. Crossing that one headed, but it's caught from Kiko Casilla. It's been a very dull game, just like the Barcelona one. Yes, passing it to us. Down the line there to Cristiano Ronaldo, who's just come on. Crossing it. Oh, hit it, James. No, what a miss, James Rodriguez. He's going to pass that one to us. We're going to play it nice and short there to James, who goes to Sherry Shev. Have the strike. Saved. Oh, we weren't in the right position. Well tackled there from Modric. Late in the game. Passing that one. Come back to me. Oh, why would you go there? Comes to us anyways. We're cutting around. We pass that one to Cristiano Ronaldo. What are you going to do, Ronaldo? Have the strike. Hit it. Oh, Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos in the 89th minute. Scores after Ronaldo's shot is blocked. Falls perfectly, great reactions, great technique, and we might get away with this one and get the win. Full time, fellas, we are leaving Ibar with the three points after Sergio Ramos goes ahead and scores a late winner there. We defeat them 1-0. Not the most comfortable of victories, but three points nonetheless. Anyways, fellas, this is where the 72nd episode of the My Player series is going to come to an end. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure that you leave a like on the video. Also, make sure that you subscribe to the channel down below if you are new around here. Make sure that you follow my social media links, which are Twitter and Instagram. Links to both of those will be in the description down below. But most importantly, fellas, I hope you have a fantastic day. It has been Jared HD here. I'm out. Peace. Bro.
money, bad money, bad money.